Hey, 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 this is PWA30 with another prediction video on the up and coming fight between Shane Mosley and Andre Berto. I'm going to talk about what each fighter needs to do to win the fight, and I'll give you my prediction on who I think is going to win at the end of this video. Now, with Berto, Berto's the younger fighter, so he's going to have to be the busier fighter. He's going to have to be the fighter that's throwing way more punches. He's going to have to force Shane to work at a fast work rate, try to uh, make him tired, and he's going to have to fight this fight on the inside, throwing a lot of body punches and throwing a lot of uppercuts. But uh, it's got to be fought on the inside because he cannot fight Shane on the outside because Mosley's too is uh, too tall and has that reach advantage as well. So fighting mostly at a distance would be like suicide. But um, plus, Birdo's gonna have to make this fight into a brawl. He'll have a better chance of beating Mosley that way because he's not gonna outbox him. And with Shane, what he's gonna have to do is use his jab to soften up Birdo and throw that power right hand that he has. He's got a pretty good left hand too, but the right hand is his power hand. And basically he just needs to box intelligently and try to fight at his pace. But he's got to make sure he doesn't wear himself out because Shane Mosley is the older fighter. And when Birdo does get in close, Shane Mosley needs to take advantage of that time to throw his body shots because Mosley's a very good body puncher. And uh, I can see him doing a lot of damage with body punches. But there's certain things about both fighters I'm kind of wondering about. Like uh, with Birdo, the main thing I'm wondering about is how good his chin is. Because I've seen him get hurt fighting guys that aren't even really known for being power punchers. And Shane Mosley's going to be the probably the strongest guy that Birdo's ever faced. Because Mosley does have knockout power. He can knock you out with one shot if he wants to. And with Mosley, the only thing I'm concerned about is will he be consistent in his performance? Because he looked great when he fought Margarito, but he didn't look too good in the fight he had before that fight when he fought Ricardo Mayorga. Now, if the Mosley that fought Mayorga is the Mosley that's going to show up for this fight against Birdo, then Mosley's going to have some problems. But if Mosley comes in in the same kind of shape that he did against um, Margarito, then it should be an easy fight for Shane. So basically my prediction is I think Shane is going to win by 8th round knockout. I think that his uh, experience, his punching power, and his height and reach advantage is going to be way too much for Berto to deal with. You know, Berto's never fought a fighter anywhere close to Shane Mosley's caliber. And honestly, I think they're um, rushing Berto too soon. I think he should have had at least two or three more fights before taking on somebody like Shane Mosley, but, um, well, we'll see, you know, well, post your comments, tell me who you think's gonna win, and, um, see you guys later.